Hi, this is JavaScript slideshow tutorial I developed earlier. So I'd just like to show it to you guys and see how it works. So this is how it's working right now. But uh, I'd like you guys to have a good look at how it's developed as well. So let's go into Notepad plus plus and we put one of these together. So let's do that now okay now in notepad plus plus the first thing i would like to do is just to find my html because i tend to use that as well then get the head in place and the title i'm just going to call it i slide okay that's my title there I'll close that close this as well the next thing I would like to do is maybe I should define a body first and follow by let me follow that by background color the background color I intend to use in this case I'm gonna make that black so that will be black and the other thing I would like to do is let me get all of the content centered then what about the fonts I intend to use some fonts in there so let me make those fonts white so those are my fonts now right here I'm gonna close the head let's close the head right there or maybe just let me bring the head up here cut that and put it right here now the next thing is maybe i should close everything first let me just close everything here then the body close the body now let's close the let's close the head is closed and we might as well just close html itself there what about fonts let's get rid of the font here as well there we close the font okay what about center let's close center as well we'll close center here right there so right here i'm going to enter my let me enter the head in there so i'll just call that slide show that's the head in there Let's close that so that will give us that's supposed to be the, the font size really so let me define my class here let's go for dev class equals i slide underscore let's go for show there okay now the next thing is I might as well just close this here so that I don't miss out on closing it yeah okay now I'm gonna add defined as follows for the images I intend to use so right here let me show you the images there they are I intend to use those five images all of these images I drew them myself they are all on YouTube already so let's continue let's call that undo that that's a mistake there here class equals let's go for i slide let it fade and close that and let's close that here as well there and in here i will now call the images okay right here let me enter the image i intend to use so in this case it's going to be known as images yeah the next thing is I like a text underneath the image that's the text I want underneath the image itself so what I'll do now is I'm going to copy this across let's copy that because I have five in total you can see I have five images so I'm going to copy that and just change the names and that is streets five and street six yeah, 
au-dessus de moi. Sweet 7 and 8. 7 and 8. There. So all I just need to do now is to change the text that I have in there. Let's set instead of no flex zone, let's change it to maybe once once upon a time in Kilburn. There. Okay, now let's change this to maybe let's go for coward. say once upon a time in Lagos here yeah, will be once upon a time no don't do that let's copy it properly that's right I should kill them copy that and come right here paste that there once upon a time in Lagos all right so here, what shall we enter there, maybe once upon a time in Morocco. So once upon a time in Morocco, I guess this will make a friend of mine very happy. So let's come in here. Uh, maybe we should change this one from Coward of the County to once upon a time in, where do I go to? Let's go for, yeah, let's go for Texas. Let's try that again. Yeah. Yeah, I used to live in Texas, so I might as well put that once upon a time in Texas. All right. So now the next thing we need to do now is to start with the JavaScript itself. Okay, right here underneath here, the following lines of codes that we actually make my slide animate that's this very one without that the slides we now animate and right here that's the lines of code for the javascript the beginning of the javascript so let's write out some functions and right there there we go so those are the lines of codes for the function that would drive this slide Okay, have a good look at it. And right underneath here, I'm going to enter the Marquis loop. But let's put it outside the outside the script itself. That is it. Okay, so have a good look at the Marquis loop. That's the Marquis loop there. Slideshow created by Captain Paul Roman. And that's me. Now, if we come down here, here I have some horizontal rules and here are the side the side of those rulers okay let's save this program now and here I'm just gonna call that maybe slide and right here let's change this to slide there so save that there we go okay before we can run this let's move all of these let's move them right above here okay there so let's give it a try now save it first and see what we've done so far well just before that i actually want this mark with me in the center let's move it down here highlight it drag it down yeah that's fine and let's see okay let's give that a run guys and there we go guys that is how the slideshow looks you can see that once upon a time in morocco once upon okay that's just a no flex zone once upon a time in kilburn you can see the marquee loop that's it that's the marquee looping around i think there should be once upon a time in texas as well and let's see there we go guys so with that i'm gonna call it the end of this tutorial but before i go let me show you guys the lines of codes one more time there we go guys right there 
for a good look at it and I'm gonna bring it down yeah take it down one more time there guys and here we have the JavaScript itself and that is that's, that's all there is to it and see the rest of the markway let me just move this in so that you can see it properly here yeah. move this in yeah that's it so with that I'm gonna call it the end of this tutorial suppose you guys enjoy it so you all have a nice day now and bye for now